Last but not least, we have Julia Walters and Cassidy Gamblin performing Woo! Ascension Day. going to do that. Charity, no one gets out of here without giving their testimony. Imagine you talking about your complexion problem. Well, judging from his skin, we're still waiting for that miracle. Oh, did you think? I thought he was adorable. For you, that is a broad category. Strange, but <laughs> cute as a bug. What was his name? Randy? Listen, there's loons again. I'm glad you're our junior counselor. So am I. It's just, well, please try to remember, Faith, that having your sister be in charge of your entire cabin isn't always the easiest. So, you're afraid I'll embarrass you? Well, you know what I mean. Oh, I know exactly what you mean. Don't worry, I'll just cut down on the chewing tobacco and only spit on the ground after the lights are out. You get it from Mother. You're so sarcastic, the both of you. If you could just be a little more, well, I don't know, easygoing? What does that mean? Well, for starters, when a boy tries to talk to you, you don't have to turn to stone or anything. What on earth? You're just, you don't act like the other girls. Well, I certainly hope I don't act like the other girls. It makes them feel uncomfortable. For one thing, I am much older than the other girls. Only a year and a half. I am not a giggling 16-year-old. See, that's just it. That's what I mean. You don't let us giggle or laugh or have a good time Charity. or- Charity! I want you to have a good time. I don't know what you're talking about. I want you to have a good time. This camp is, it's a really special place and it meant so much to me last year and I want it to be the same for you. Listen, it's simple. I'll just ask Pastor Tolfson to switch me to another cabin. No, it's babe, no trouble. No, please. Really, it doesn't matter. No, no, no. June can take the Naomi cabin. I can take the Ruth no, cabin. Babe, It'll no, be no trouble no. at all. Listen, I think that I would be better with the younger I girls. wish I hadn't said a thing. I really I'm do. I'm not just saying this, Faith, Charity. no. I, I think I'm just nervous is all. It's my first day, and I want people to like me. You met someone here last year, didn't you? That's why it was so special. Well, I met lots of people last year. A boy, I mean. And I accepted our Lord as my personal savior. What was his name? Wesley. You wrote, his in you wrote his name on the inside of one of your notebooks about a dozen times. <laughs> Ooh, there they go again. They're going crazy out there. It's so mournful. They just sound so lonely and despairing. Can you imagine being that horny? <laughs> <laughs> Charity, I... I don't know why you have to insist on reducing everything to... To what? To... The, to the lowest common denominator. You can't even say it. You can't even say the word. Anyway, you don't know a thing about loons. And nothing's beautiful to you unless it's awful and sad and mournful and touching. They have half a dozen different cries and each one has its own specific purpose. I'm just afraid you're gonna turn into a spinster. There's a cry for alarm, there's a feeding call, there's, well, there's a mating call, of course. My sister, the spinster Sunday school teacher. There's one call for when they're lost, for when they've become separated and they can't find each other. It's, it's just such a terrible sound. I've heard it before, it's so terribly lonely. Just, please Faith, I need you. I'd be twice as scared if you weren't. All right. And can we just give it up again for all the people who came up and yeah! Excellent job, everybody. All right.
Thank you all so much for coming out to the YATC Acting Showcase. Um, I believe the musical showcase is still going on in main dining, so if you want to see some of those performances, you can. But thank you again so much. Thank you.